And so behind closed doors on the Gold Coast resumes one of the A-League's most fascinating matchups. Newcastle rarely lose in Queensland. Brisbane have a great record in the Hunter and both are in pretty good nick at the moment. Brisbane's problems in scoring goals in the first halves of matches this season have been well documented. They have addressed that somewhat in recent weeks as Corey Brown slings one in. Steered away and good distance on that clearing header by Bogart. Retrieved in the deep by O'Neill. Trumpets with a touch, but it favoured O'Neill. Now Maratovic and McDonald trying to create the angle on oh, Luis Italiano. Totally wrong footed. And Scott McDonald has his fourth goal in three games. Everything he touches turns to goals at the moment. Uncompromising defender, Nigel Boga. Here he is in action again. Just about got enough on that. Back towards Luis Italiano. Famously, of course, has uh, been shown the red card on 10 occasions, an A-League record. But uh, perhaps to his credit, Robbie, not for nigh on four years. As Robbie Fowler continues that conversation with Ali Reza Fagani, who's the fourth official tonight. So he's cleaned up his act. Now here's Roy O'Donovan. Got a chance to square the ledger. He was left all alone, and Tom Aldred is given Corey Brown a heck of a bait there. Another stat that sort of underlines just how level this game has been. 12 incursions into either penalty area. About to become 13, you fancy, by Joe O'Shea. Not the best quality. And pop out here, though, for Brad Inman. And they found a bit of room here for Tom Aldridge. Good save, Italiano. Maratovic with the follow-up effort. And Aldridge appealed in vain for a handball. They'll get a corner, Brisbane. It could and possibly should have been more. Yeah, what a chance. And I think on pure chances created, they can really have few complaints. They just haven't been good enough in the front third. They haven't been able to create Brisbane have been too good defensively. Although they've set deep and we've set it, Tony Young hasn't had a save to make, really. Still might have one to make. Petrato, oh, so it's off the woodwork from Roy O'Donovan. And they were that close to claiming a share of the spoils. And Roy O'Donovan to claiming a goal against the club he left just last month. Wow. And that will do. Scott McDonald's goal proves to be the winner for the second time in two home matches in the space of a week. And the Raw win three in a row for the first time under Robbie Fowler and further cement their spots in the top six there now. Just one point behind Wellington in third and further clear of Perth behind them for the Jets. The playoff dream is surely over, as is their unbeaten start to life under Carl Robinson.